Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Square pixels versus non-square pixels. So, we often think of pixels in terms of the square pixels and that every pixel is one, two, three, four across and that they are a perfect square. The truth is that because of the way televisions used to be made, they all had oblong pixels and they were a little bit taller than they were wide. When you're working with non-square pixels, you can end up in a couple of different combinations. One can be that you took a video that was supposed to be 640 by 480 and you encoded it at 480 by 480 and you said, but the pixel shape of these 480 pixels is such that they are 1.33 by 1, and so they are wider than they are tall. This is how you do some of the anamorphic or the pixel aspect ratio changes for encoding, and it's a great way to make a video look better at a lower bit rate is by using non-square pixels, because the truth is that people are not encoded in such a manner that they have as much data width-wise, usually, as they do height-wise. People are long and tall, usually, when they're standing up. And so the amount of detail that you need in the person is more top to bottom than it is left to right. Now, if the people were laying down or you're shooting pictures of cars, that might change. But generally, we are more sensitive to the up and down pixels than we are to the left and right pixels.